Okie dokie, so I just want to show some games, really educational computer science kind of games that I quite like on Congregate, which is a website full of Flash games. So let's go to my favourites, and I'm just going to do some walkthroughs of some really decent programming teaching games. So the first one is going to be Lightbot, I don't know how many episodes this will take. So Lightbot is probably the easiest of the computer science flash games that I found on this website. Put it into cin cinematic mode. Um, it's just... For someone who's never programmed before, I'd say this is quite a good... good thing to play with, possibly. So, let's read through. Maybe turn down the sound. Actually, down there. Okay. So artificial intelligence is hard to program. Not every bot ever created can manoeuvre and function on its own. Rather, some bots run along a path that they program with presets for them for various situations. Your job is to light up all the blue tiles in the factory by the commands you issue to the light bot. Good luck. So, silly backstory. What's that? Okay. So let's start a new game. Program your bot to move and light up the blue tiles. Space continue. So there's the robot. There's the blue tile that I want it to light up. Let the bot go through the steps. Okay, so it's not... It's expecting you to get it all on your own, so let's, let's go through this bit by bit. Try setting these commands to the right. So you need to drag these on here. Like so. So put an arrow in main method, function 1, function 2, total command 0, go. What's happened there? Okay. So let's, what does that do? It's like, t go forward, turning, maybe, don't know, light, function 1 and 2. So it's just lit up these two buttons, so let's try forward, forward, light, forward, forward, light. There you go, done. Try turning your box. So let's just go through for a few minutes. So here's a thing in the way here, so I need to get around it. So let's try turning clockwise. He just turns. Okay. Clockwise, forward, and then we're going to rotate back again. From here, so how about one, two, three, four. Go forward, four. One, two, three, four. And then rotate anti-clockwise and go forward again right up there you go easy jumping can get you over barriers so here's a barrier it's highlighted to jump there it's reset to the know let's try go reset just puts you back to the beginning okay jump up or down with this command okay Try it. Jump. Jump. Okay. So to get rid of commands, you can just drop them anywhere. Okay. Try going forward. Forward. What happens then? He just keeps walking and can't do anything. So if you jump. Jump. Okay. Can you go forward? No. So it looks like you might have to jump off. Yep. So forward, jump, jump, forward, and then let's rotate anti-clockwise relative to the rover, and then light up three lights, so light, forward, light, forward, light, that's three and that should be it. There we go, jumping can also get you to new heights. This is jumping up steps, okay? Let's so go forward one, jump, jump, forward, turn, and then forwards along to there. Forward, jump, jump, forward, forward, jump, jump, forward. Take clockwise, and we go one, two, three, four, five along. One, two, three. Well, turn the right one. Go. Get it now? Yes. 
Okay, so jump, forward, forward, rotate, forward, 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 rotate, jump, 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 flux. Jump, forward, forward, rotate, one, two, three, one, two, three, rotate, one, two, three, flight, and just fitting in the main method, probably by no accident there. Okay. Not enough space, try creating functions using F1 and F2. So, so far we've just been using commands in a sequence to do fairly simple linear stuff and now we're going to start looking at control flow by calling functions. <coughs> F1 and F2 relate to the functions below to the right. So if you put F1 in here and call it, it will then call all those, whatever's in those blocks, I guess. So, jump, 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 jump. Okay, so this is the first slightly challenging level, so I think I'll do this one and then close the video. So, go forward, let's just do it naively. See what happens when we run out. Forward, jump, jump. Forward, jump, jump. Rotate, jump, jump, forward, jump, jump, rotate, jump, jump, turn the light on, jump off. See how far that gets us. Yeah. Let's rotate to the right, forward, forward, light. Quite right, okay. Needed one more, so let's go into the function. So let's cheat and use the functions just as extra. Right, so that should work now. So rotate twice, rotate, rotate, and then go one, two, three, four, five, six, and then light. One, two, Three, four, five, six, and then turn the light on. Okay, let's try that. So this is a dodgy use of, this is using function more as go to, because these would actually return, but because they return at the end, it would just end. There we go, done. Reusing functions is great for repetitive tasks, so that's what I was not doing before. We'll look at that one later. Okay.